Captain George Vancouver was an officer in the British Royal Navy when he was put to the task of commanding an expedition to the Pacific Northwest. Previously, he had been in the crew of Captain James Cook, another famous explorer hailing from Great Britain. Sadly, however, after having succeeded in strengthening his country's claim to the Pacific Northwest during his expedition, he died only three years later at the age of 40. This is his story. He entered the Pacific Northwest in 1792. While sailing, he passed the mouth of the Columbia River because he doubted that it went anywhere, leaving it up for grabs and going through the Strait of Juan de Fuca instead. Robert Gray, an American explorer, later sailed up it. Vancouver also spent the summer of 1792 exploring the Puget Sand, where many bodies of water and physical features were named by him and his crew. Later that summer, Vancouver sailed north from the Puget Sand region through the Strait of Georgia, which separates Vancouver Island from the mainland. After sailing around Vancouver Island, he met Spain's representative, Bodega y Quadra, at Nootka Sam. When George got back from the expedition, he became very troubled. He was weighed down by everything from an expedition astronomer claiming that Vancouver didn't pay him, to even a former crew member assaulting him on the street. Sadly, he died at the young age of 40, although not due to the attack. To sum it all up, George Vancouver was an outgoing explorer. Although he helped Great Britain quite a bit in the race for the Pacific Northwest, back at home he received little thanks. Rock on, George Vancouver! May your soul prosper a millennia!